Akbar and Birbal. Strange. It's really very strange. So many thefts are being reported in town. The thief is moving around scot-free. Are the security forces asleep? You, you tell me. You are the chief of security. The patrolling in the sensitive areas has been increased, Your Majesty. But what's the use of that? The thief has not been caught. It seems that the thief is very shrewd. He doesn't leave any trace behind him. Your Majesty, these thefts have made all the rich people of the town sleepless. I want the thief to be caught as soon as possible. Tighten the security of the entire town. Anyone found neglecting his duty would be punished. Your order is our command, Your Majesty. Hmm, a hundred gold coins are a little expensive for these carpets. Hmm, these are not ordinary carpets. These are from Persia. Hmm, bring me four more carpets when you go next. Sure, I'm planning a trip next week. Is there any room available for the night? I am sorry, there is no room. I just need it for the night. I'll leave early in the morning. If a room was available, it would have been my pleasure to accommodate you. If you don't mind, can I spread the sheet in that corner and spend the night? No, we don't allow that. So many thefts are taking place in town these days. If you sleep in the open and get robbed, we would be blamed for that. <laughs> you need not worry about that. I have nothing that I fear being stolen. What's your name? Raghav. Raghav, if you wish, you can spend the night at my house. That's very kind of you. I shall be obliged. Come with me. Don't make it a habit, sir. Otherwise, we will have to close our inns. <laughs> <laughs> Parvati, we have a guest for the night. Please serve the dinner fast. Thank you very much, sir. I have had my dinner. All right. You must be very tired of your journey. Take rest in this room. I will send milk for you. I will always remember your hospitality, sir. It's very hot and stuffy here. I'll open a window. Is everything all right? Yes, sir. Good. If you notice anyone with suspicious movements, arrest him immediately. Yes, sir. Who's there? Who's there? You? What are you doing here? Shh! Don't shout. Let me go. Tell me what you're doing inside the house at this hour. And what is this that you're carrying? If you let me go, I promise to share the content of this box equally between the two of us. Alright? Shame on you. You're a god. You should be protecting people's property. And you yourself are stealing? Don't you have any respect for this uniform? Don't deliver sermons like a saint. 
Let me go peacefully. No, I won't let you go. All right then. Take this. I will teach you a lesson now. Thief! 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 thief. Where? Where? Where is the thief? Sir, I caught this man red-handed with your valuables. No, sir. He's telling a lie. I'm not the thief. Shut up. You should be ashamed of yourself. I gave you shelter and you tried to rob me. But sir, believe me, I have not stolen this box. Shut up. Come with us. I'm relieved that your guards have finally arrested the thief. Long live the Emperor. Your Majesty, I'm... I'm innocent. Please, please believe me. I'm not the thief. Every criminal says the same thing when caught. Tell me the truth. I've been framed, Raja Birbal. I'm innocent. What do you mean? You have been caught red-handed by the guard. No, 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 Raja Birbal. I caught him red-handed. When I refused to share the loot with him, he simply put the blame on me. He took advantage of being a... a guard. I'm an ordinary man, Raja Birbal. How would I prove my innocence? You need not worry. You leave that to me. Come inside after a while and just do what I have told you to. I will obey you, sir. All right. God, tell me now, where did you catch him? I was patrolling the area and noticed a gate opening. That alerted me. I saw this man fleeing with the box and I immediately caught him. Raja Birbal, Raja Birbal, my son slipped and fell unconscious while plucking mangoes from your garden. Can you kindly send someone to help me pick him up? He is very heavy. You stay here. Guard, you and Raghav, you both look very strong. Go and bring the boy from the garden carefully. You hold the shoulders. Listen, brother. You know very well that you broke into the merchant's house, stole his box and were running away when I caught you. But you lied and trapped me in this offense. Why? I offered to share half of that with you. But you did not agree, you fool. <laughs> now you will be punished for that. But sir, why should I be punished when I have not stolen? You are the thief. You are the thief. No, not me. You are the thief. You are the thief. You are the thief. You are the thief. Sir, this guard is a real thief. I heard him confess trapping this gentleman in this theft. Shame on you. You have disgraced the uniform. You should be punished. Arrest him. Birbal, your trick to use the unconscious witness was awesome. This boy deserves a reward of 1,000 gold coins for his help. What? 1,000 gold coins? <laughs> Hundreds of rats lived happily in a deserted house near a riverside. One day, 